Hey everybody, Jeremy here. So today I'm gonna to show you how you can make teriyaki glazed chicken breasts with rice inside of the Ninja Foodie pressure cooker and steam fryer. This is gonna be really easy and it's gonna be very fast to cook and that's what I like about it. Let me show you what you need to do. First of all, you need the chicken. Now, what kind of chicken do you get? Well, it's best if you get some chicken breasts like I have here. These are chicken breast tenderloins, which were already cut up, prepackaged, and all I did was put about three fourths of a cup or so of some teriyaki marinade, whichever type that you like, inside of a big freezer bag like this. Throw your chicken in there, make sure that everything is all good and coated, toss it in the refrigerator, and let it sit there for about 30 minutes, an hour. Let it get nice and familiar with that marinade. That's pretty much it. Now you just have to gather the rest of the ingredients and we're gonna to toss them all into the Ninja Foodie. All right, so what I've got here is two cups of white rice. Um, right here is two tablespoons of butter. Here is four cups of water. All right, so let's start adding things to this. So let's open this up. And the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna add our rice and we're gonna add our butter and we're gonna add the water. You can also use frozen vegetables. If you have frozen vegetables, you wanna put that in there, you can do it. All right, so toss all that in there. Now we got the water, pour that over in there. Beautiful. And now I'm just gonna take this little spatula here. Let me move over to this side. And I'm just gonna stir everything up. It's not on, as you can see, it's not on. So we got that going good. Now, what we're gonna do is whoosh. We're gonna grab the reversible rack. Comes with the, comes with the unit, just like this, right? And we're gonna put it in the lower position, which means we're not gonna have it like this so that it comes up towards the top. We're gonna have it so that it's more towards the bottom. All right, and we're gonna also cover it with aluminum foil. All right, so we're gonna lay this down, switch sides again. I'm gonna lay this down here. All right, now we're gonna take our chicken and we're gonna lay our chicken right there on top of the aluminum foil. We're dropping them on here. Now I did not do anything to this chicken besides uh, coating it in this marinade. So no prior seasoning. We'll see how it turns out. It's always room to switch things up to make it more of your style, your taste. Of course, recommend just wearing gloves. Makes it easier for the cleanup process. I'm gonna put one across the bottom here. And one more right there. Perfect fit. Oh, almost forgot. <laughs> there was one more after that. Now perfect fit. Okay, so that's it. I'm gonna close this lid down, turn it on. All right, we're gonna move it over to the steam crisp function. So we're just gonna move this over to the middle, steam crisp. We're gonna keep it at 390 and we're gonna move the time to 15 minutes. And once again, up here, it does not matter what position this is in. This only matters if you're pressure cooking, but if you're doing the steam crisp, it doesn't matter, okay? I'm gonna hit start. We're gonna let that steaming happen, and then once the steaming is done, it's gonna just cook it up for us, and when it's done, we're gonna come back, see what it tastes like. Really fast, really simple, you gotta love it. Okay, all done. So it took about 10 minutes or so to get through the initial uh, steaming process just to kind of get everything started. And then that's when the 15 minutes kicked in. So let's just say about 25-ish minutes to get this all done. And here we are, the finished product. Here's a look at that chicken. 
all nice and cooked through. Let's try this first by itself. You know, for something that didn't have any proper seasoning on it, just that teriyaki uh, marinade, chicken's actually pretty good. And it's not tough. Let's try it with the rice. Yeah, it goes pretty good with the rice as well. Let me try the rice by itself. It's got a little bit of that teriyaki marinade on it too. Okay, okay, yeah. Now because teriyaki marinade can be pretty powerful, that's mostly what I'm tasting when I taste this rice. That's got the teriyaki already kind of infused on it. But it goes really, really good with this chicken. If I can just play with my food for a little bit, as you can see, it comes apart pretty easily. I guess that's that steam crisping for you, you know? Not tough, cooked all the way through, and not burned to a crisp. Very good, very good. So yeah, this steam crisping stuff is pretty legit. And this is a nice, quick, filling meal that you can whip up in less than a half hour. All you have to do is just put your chicken in the marinade and just let it um, sit in the fridge for 30 minutes to an hour. Then you come out, throw it all in the pot and let the foodie do all the work for you. So what more can you ask for? All right, that's it for me guys. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, I'm Jeremy. Talk to you later.